Hey, yum yums. What's up, yum yums, yum 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 yums. Hi, guys. I know that's a reflection of a bright light. But I wanted to come in and I wanted to talk to my yum yums. Good evening. Good, Well, good morning is past. Good afternoon has gone. And good evening is now. And almost good night and another day. Hold on, guys. Sorry for the lighting in my yum yum's face. So basically, guys, I'm here. I'm in my kitchen. Let me guys show you. My, my microwave broke on me, guys. Yo, that thing broke on me. I went to put something in there and that thing starts sparkling, baby. Oh, well, I'm just going to do without a microwave for a good while because I'm not, I'm not buying one right now. So I'm in my kitchen. This is my coffee, guys. My Folgers. Folgers in your cup. I still got my little pretty red and black radio. My red and black micro, um, coffee pot. And, uh, my little red thing. So, yes, guys, I'm in the kitchen here. And, um, just finished doing my kitchen. And I'm about to, um, hold on. I'm about to actually put me on some, um, chicken. Guys, I have not had fried food in so very long. And so, tonight... I know that it's getting pretty late, guys. Hi, Yum Yums. How are you? How are all my Yum Yums? I hope that you all had a wonderful, amazing, prospered Tuesday. Hold on, guys. Now, y'all know Anastasia's a big girl now. Y'all gonna see Anastasia. These pajamas ain't got no last get in the waist, baby. So, hold on, guys. I'm gonna take you over here with me and show you exactly what I am doing. I'm trying to keep the lighting out of your face. So, yes, I'm in the kitchen right now and um i came in tonight because i want to know guys where in the h-e-l-l is adrian slave variety did she book her flight already to go i think she said she was going to um i'm not even sure where she said she was going i know she said something about i wonder if that's hot enough guys booking a flight she was going back home or something to see her people but i don't think she went this early do you think she went this early i'm not even sure so yes guys do not come for anastasia guys because you guys know you don't see me eating too much fried food you know not really fried food but tonight listen tonight baby it is what it is you feel me this is what i'm frying because i want them so, the next time around I eat some fried food, maybe next year sometime. So, yes, I'm cooking some fried chicken wings. Can you smell them, guys? Because they're going to be amazing. So, I basically marinated them in some mustard. And I added my garlic powder, my onion powder, my Mrs. Dash, my pepper. And I even put hot sauce to them to give it that crunch. With the, the mustard, marinated the mustard. So I basically marinated them in. Um, oh, wait, hold on, guys. Oh no, I don't want to. I don't want to force this because there's like one piece left in the pot. Let me wash my hands, okay? And then we'll talk. Um, I don't want to force them in the pot and crowd it because then the flour would start to break up. Alright, so yeah, so we're in the, I'm washing my hands, guys. Where is Adrian's Slave Variety? Sharika has uh, MIA. Huh? So I think, I don't know if she said Chicago, is it what the guy that she was going back to? Or was it Milwaukee? I'm not even sure, guys. I'm not even sure where exactly she was going but I know she said that she was going to be heading home to go back to see her people and my question is to you yum yum did she put smiley 
an adult daycare. What did she do with Smiley? She couldn't take Smiley with her because, you know, she's going to see her mom and all. You know. That's Anastasia, y'all. Anastasia is the big girl, big girl. It's time for the big girl. Hey, it's time for the big girl. Hey, it's time for the big girl. Hey. Yeah, so <laughs> she uh went back. We're going to go talk now because the chicken is on. All right? I like to make sure my my kitchen is clean before I go to bed. I do not go to bed without my kitchen or my downstairs clean. I do not like a nasty house, guys. But you guys can all see that. You all know somebody's going to come in and say, Oh, Anastasia, you always want to show your house. Well, I'll show my house to my yum-yums. All right, guys? So here we have it. The chicken is on. So let's go and chit-chat for a little bit. So yeah, I said, hey, I'm in the front room. I'm in the front room now, guys. You see? I'm in the front room. I'm in the front room. So I said, where the hell is Adrian? Um, for the last few days, I have not seen anything posted with her up here. So my question to you, Yum Yums, is... Somebody leave it in the bottom of the comment box and tell Anastasia where has she's gone because she is MIA and she has not been on here for a couple of days or so. Y'all guys know that that's not Adrian Slave Variety slash Sharika slash Nikki. Y'all know that's not her. She comes in with a video, maybe two or three at the most in a day. So I looked and I said, okay, well, it's a possibility that she went where she said she was going, you know. Um, but I didn't think that she left this soon or this early, you know what I mean? To, oh, gosh. Sorry, guys. Oh, baby. And stuff can't be showing all that. Now, and a rate, and a rate, and a rate. But pray for me, guys, because these things got to get up on that thing on Friday, honey. And he got to check them. And I hope and pray to God that they okay. Pray for me. Pray for me. And, um, yeah. So I was looking for her. And I was like, where the hell is she? I have not seen her. Guys, you know it's nighttime. Guys, you know Clarita had to come off, honey. And <clears throat> I done washed up and put my scarf on, came downstairs. I said, hey, you know what? I took that chicken out earlier and I was going to cook it. But I was like. I didn't want it right away. I just didn't want it right away. But normally if I eat like this time of the evening, I would sit up for hours and hours, you know, um, and I would be doing things around my house to digest my food. And I always chew like two or three times before I go to sleep because um, I want to be sure that my food has digested and, you know, I don't want to lay down on a full stomach like that because it will come up in my chest and it will give me heartburn. But guys, where the hell is Adrian? Can someone please leave it in the bottom of the comment box? Because uh, I ain't seen no one here for a couple of days, y'all. Oh, Lord, have mercy. Um, oh, mm, smiley. Mm, where are you, Adrian? Did you go back to see your mom and... um um? Your auntie, Raynette, and your family, because you did say something about you going home for the holiday. And um, I'm wondering if that's what she did. And also, guys, do you guys think that it ain't my business, but I'm going to say it anyway. Do you guys think that Miss Beloved sent her something, that she sent her sister something? Although, you know, Adrian can be very, very naive and very selfish. And if Beloved sent her something, do you guys think that she would reveal that her sister, Miss Beloved Life, sent her something for Christmas? I think Miss Beloved has a wonderful, generous heart. You know, she's doing amazing things in her life. And now she did this, uh, uh, she did this, um, video where she was supposed to be in the kitchen, supposed to have been cooking the seafood and sit down and eat the seafood and this, that, and the other and whatever. But do you guys think that Adrian would reveal it, that her sister sent her something, you know? Do you guys think and believe that if, if Beloved Life sent her something for Christmas, do you guys believe that Adrian would accept it? Or do you guys believe that she would accept it and she would not reveal it 
or speak upon it. She would just keep it in the closet that, you know, Miss Beloving sent her nothing. Well, technically speaking, you guys know that she can be very, very naive. You know, she can be very, very naive. And um, if Beloved sent her something for Christmas, I wonder what it might be. Do you guys think that it would be a gift overall? Or do you guys think that it would be money? Well, technically speaking, it's probably one or the other. But in the same token, do you think that Adrian Slave Variety would reveal that and say, Hey, my sis sent me this for Christmas. Oh, come on, guys. Come on. We have to give her the benefit of the doubt sometimes. You know what I mean? I mean, you know, although Beloved may send her something. And I think that Miss Beloved has a, a sincere heart. You know what I mean? Like, but knowing Adrian, if you send, if she sends her something, she probably uh, may reject it. Or uh, Miss Beloved may tell her, you know, I don't even know if Beloved have her phone number because... She just, just all together, just fell all out with her sister, fell all out with with, with Walter, fell all out with, <laughs> with Shannon and stuff like that. Like, get your life, girl. Get your life. Get your life. Now, the only companion that you really have now is Smiley. Because, oh, quote, unquote, mm -hmm. Remy, I don't hear and see Remy no more. Oh, my, 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 Mr. Greg, I don't hear or see Mr. Greg anymore. Oh, what happened to the man in the bubble? Has he traveled out yet, guys? Mm, I hope he be okay. Uh, what happened to... What is the guy? Oh, Mr. Tesla. Mr. Tesla. Hey, Tesla, are you getting Adrian something for Christmas? Because you know she's trying to come for you. Mm-hmm. So, Remy, uh, Mr. Tesla, um, Gregory, um, what is the young man name that used to go over there and sit with her a lot? Um, it was a young, dark-skinned guy. He used to go sit with her a lot. I don't see none of them. Absolutely none of them come to her place anymore. What in the world is going on? She has ran everything and everybody away from her. Now, the only source of, of a friend or a companion that she has now is only Smiley. Well, Smiley, I hope you be there for a while because if you get on her nerve. She's going to tie her ass up and she's going to get rid of you too. <laughs> but my question is, where is she? Has she traveled out? Did she travel out to Chicago or Milwaukee or Wisconsin? I, listen, I don't know. All I know, I remember her saying something about she was going to be traveling out. But has she traveled out yet? Because it's been some days since Adrian been on this YouTube to make a video. That is not like her. Whether she's at Aunt Raynette's house, she comes up with a video. Even if it's about the throwback videos with the kids and the family and stuff, she comes up with a video. Or some uh, out of the uh, ordinary topic, she'll come up with something. But this has been a couple of days, guys. Like maybe four days. Or three days at the most that you have not seen Adrian on here making a video. So maybe she will come up tomorrow with a video. She's probably in Chicago, Milwaukee, Wisconsin, or whatever. L listen, it's just I just found it strange that she's not on the YouTube because that is not like her. But let's get back to Miss Beloved life. Hey, Miss Beloved, are you going to send Adrian a, a Christmas gift? Do you think that she would accept the gift that you sent to her? Or do you think that she will return it? We shall see. We shall see if Miss Beloved is going to send her sister a, a Christmas gift or some money. And we shall see if it is so and if it is said and if it is done. If Adrian receives that gift or whatever the means may be. Is she going to accept it or reject it? Do you think she would tell us, guys? Mm. I'm not sure. But at any rate, guys, how are my yum-yums? How have you guys day been today? I hope that you all had an amazing, a prosperous, a wonderful, wonderful day today. It was pretty nice here where I reside at. Very, very nice day. Um, so it's kind of a unique day, you know, in a strange way. But it was overall, it was okay. So yes, guys, I had a taste for me some. Mm -hmm. Don't come for me. Because I want some chicken wings. At least you know that I'm not going to cook them in some hungry jack. 
I ain't gonna cook my chicken wings in no hungry jack pancake mix. I'm cooking them in the right direction and the right thing. You're cooking them in some flour. That's what I'm cooking my chicken wings in. I really wanted me some fried fish, but I'll leave the fish for another day. I have some fish in there. I'll make some fish for another day. But guys, do not, do not, do not cook your chicken wings in no hungry jack, uh, 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 hungry jack pancake mix. Because, you know, Adrian cooked the damn cramps in some damn Hungry Jack uh, pancake mix and stuff. And that damn shrimp burnt the all up and stuff. And she said that she burnt the damn things up. Who does that? I mean, they said that people can cook shrimps in some pancake batter. But never in a million years would I ever try that. Never try that. Ain't going to try that. Will not try that. So I'm cooking me some chicken wings and I'm cooking them in some flour and I season them things to perfection. So let me tell you what I basically put in mine. So I cleaned my chicken wings off. I made sure the hairs wasn't on there and I put them in the zinc. I marinated them in some mustard and some hot sauce and some Mrs. Dash, a little bit of pepper, just a little bit of salt, um, garlic powder, onion powder. Uh, what else? What else? What else? What else? I put on there. Oh, and a little bit of Italian dressing. Just a little bit. Not much. A little bit of that. And I marinated them very, very, very well. Very, very well. And I let the, the grease get hot. And I dropped them. So, guys, come on. Let's go. Follow me to the kitchen and check on the chicken wings. Because you know I ain't going to fry my chicken wings in no hungry jack. No hungry jack. <clears throat> pancake mix I floured them down and I dropped them in the hot grease <laughs> let's go you know Anastasia being real silly tonight I must be getting tired guys so yeah I'm just sitting in the front room and I'm going to look at TV for a little bit I'm going to get me two bottles of water I had to go into the market today because I needed my water guys I love water I absolutely love water okay guys so let's see what's going on with these chicken wings. They smell amazing. Mmm. Yeah. go right there. They're not quite brown. I want them to get brown. So Anastasia can tarish it up. I say so Anastasia can tarish it up. I'm going to tarish it up when they come out of there. I'm going to tear it. I'm going to tear it. I'm going to tear them chicken wings. I'm going to tear that shit up. <laughs> Guys, I must be getting tired because I'm silly as ever. But so, yeah. So, I was like wondering, like, where the hell is Adrian? What the world? What in the mess? Hey, guys, I want you guys to check out this movie. Sorry, I'm digging in my shirt. Let me tell you the name of the movie. It's called... Kimberly Nightmare. It's a Nigerian movie. Um, and it the movie is so deep. Now, I'm giving you guys the title. It's called Kimberly Nightmare. Um, Nigerian movie. Go check that movie out. I'm just going to tell you that how promiscuous, how very promiscuous, um, a male figure, you know, you know, you have two guys that's uh, supposed to be quote unquote ride or die, supposed to be buddies, supposed to be friends, supposed to be piles. The gentleman worked on the job um, where he was uh, employed at on the job by his boss. That's all I'm going to tell you, because if I say any more, there will be no sense in watching the movie because I've been told the whole story. Guys, go watch that movie. It is in English. It's not in, you know, it's not in Nigeria or in African um, speaking. It's, a, it's in English. They talking in English. The movie is deep, guys. It is deep. So it's called Kimberly Nightmare Nigerian Movie. And when you guys go watch that yum yums, please Watch it from beginning to end. I tell you, when you guys see this movie, it is good. You're going to get hooked on these movies because I am hooked. I am hooked on these movies. I was watching it earlier today, all the way from the beginning to the end. 
Very good, interesting movie. Um, I think there's a part two. Yeah, part two, I think. I haven't gotten to that one yet because I just watched the, 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 the first part of the movie. But guys, go watch it. It is so damn deep. It tells you sometimes how... You know, you hang out with your buddy, you know, your homie, you know what I mean? And, you know, you invite your buddy over to your crib and you're not knowing that your buddy might be eyeballing your girl or your wife or some shit like that. That there. That's all I can tell you about the movies. But just go watch it, guys. It is an amazing movie. <laughs> it is a really, really good movie, guys. So on that note, guys, somebody... Please leave it in the bottom of the comment box and tell Anastasia where Adrian went because she's missing in action and haven't seen her in like four days. Y'all know that Adrian Slay Variety put her videos up, but I haven't seen her in like four days. The last video that I saw was like about two or three days ago. Two days ago, to be precise. The, move, the, the video says two days ago. But I think she probably traveled out early to go see her people. But if you know, leave it in the comment box for me so I can know. Because um, when I look for her videos, there's no videos of her. So, But I really truly believe that she traveled out to see her family and her mom and everything. So, yum yums on that note. Hey, guys, I'm going to tear these chicken wings up. I'm going to tear it up. I ain't lying. I'm going to tear it up. I'm going to tear it up. I'm going to eat the chicken wings, y'all. I'm going to tear them up. Mm -hmm. But I ain't cook mine in no Hungry Jack uh, pancake, man. I use regular flour. Ain't that what you supposed to do? Sometimes I like to cook them naked because I don't normally like to cook them in flour but tonight i want a good chicken wing guys a good chicken wings so if any of my yum yums had any chicken wings fried chicken wings tonight hey leave it at the bottom of the comment box but if you are interested or you want some chicken wings some fried chicken wings hey guys go get you some chicken wings let me tell y'all something about them damn chicken wings i went over there to get a family pack of chicken wings them chicken wings were 24 dollars and 99 cents I said, you must be on the that damn, you, uh, you, you all right? Are you okay? Are you the crazy? Do you think I'm going to pay $25 for a pack of damn family chicken wings? Yo, I got the small pack that cost me $13. $13 for like, what, about seven chicken wings in the damn pack? Redeck your last. We're not going to be able to eat after a while. But you know, when you want what you want, you go get what you get and do what you do. Make it do what it do. And that's what I wanted. I wanted me some fried chicken wings. And that's what I'm going to eat. I'm going to tarsh. Y'all hear me? I said I'm going to tarsh. All right. I'm tired, y'all. So I love you, yum yums. I, again, hope that you all had an amazing, wonderful, prosper day. To God be the glory. Happy, happy Tuesday. And hump day is here almost as follow. So when we get over hump day... We make it. So, guys, pray for me. You know, and it starts, I told you guys that, you know, us as females, we have to stay on um, very consistent on top of our health and everything. So, I'm going to get my yearly mammogram, and I pray to God to be the glory that it comes out okay, you know. And if you are over 40 and um, you have a history of that in your family, which I don't have a history of in my family, but, um, but just, you know, if you do, it is always... Um, very known and um that you should go and you should have your mammograms your annual uh gyn smear and you know colonoscopy and things of that sort so on that note guys i love you yum yums stay positive stay blessed keep that peace stay out of trouble and let no hurt harm and danger come against you may god continue to bless you all and happy 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 hanukkah holidays to you all have an amazing amazing wonderful holiday all right, because Christmas is just near. Okay, guys? Love you. I'll talk to you later. I got to go check on my chicken wings. I smell them. Love you, yum yums. Bye.